what we're going to do uh, today is kind of on the dark side, I guess you could say. Maybe a little gray in the gray area, but you've seen me do videos on how to jailbreak an iPod, right? As you can see, I've jailbroke my iPod with all different icons on there, which are the different applications that I have. And if I think if you can see in the corner, um, right over here, right over there-ish, there is a, uh, well, yeah, that's the mail icon. Now you might be saying, Jeff, how did you get mail on your iPod without, well, on a jailbroken iPod without paying for it? And you're going to say, well, check out this video because I'm going to tell you exactly how to do it. Um, so first thing you have to have in order to be able to do this, <clears throat> by the way, is the jailbroke iPod. You can be running the 1.1.1 1, 1 .1 or the 1.1.2 um, firmware. It works on both. So that's really nice. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to installer. So as I go to installer right now, it's loading it up. It's going to load installer, right? You get to the installer. And uh, you're going to go to sources, okay? Once you're at sources, the sources page it should look somewhat like uh, this, the different sources. You're going to click edit. There's an edit button on the top right. You're going to click edit. Once you click edit, you're going to click add. You're going to add. It's going to pop up a dialog box. And now you're going to add what, what we call a source. Um, it's really simple to do. You're just going to type in the URL. And the URL for this to get, to, uh, to get the uh, iPhone applications on your iPod is called AppleRepo.com. I'll put it in the show notes so you can just input it if you don't know how to spell it or whatever. But I'll put it in the show notes just so you can, you know, see it there. And you can type it in yourself. Um, but it's AppleRepo.com. So you're going to put that and you're going to click OK. Once you click OK, it'll refresh the sources. Once it's refreshed, you go back to the install button. Now you'll see, you're going to see this. iPhone 1.1.1 apps for the iPod and iPhone 1.1.2 apps if you can I don't know if you can see that hold on let me try to get a shot of that you can see that right there right you see it right there I did the 1.1.2 because that's the firmware I'm running and essentially what you're gonna do is the, before you inst don't install any applications yet do not install any applications which first thing you have to do is run the two prep programs which are at the bottom it's the mail prep program and the Google Maps prep program if you don't run those the applications are not gonna work correctly so run those two first then install mail and then install google maps and the rest of them you don't have to install every one though let me make that let me make that known you can install just the ones you want as of now i only installed uh, maps and mail and you know it's really simple to set up it, it, all you need is the wi-fi connection and to be able to click with your fingers basically then once you restart you'll have the mail icon in the bottom or, or wherever you have your icon there you'll see it in the bottom and I have to scroll over to the next page to get the maps. Maps is also over there. I don't know if you see that, but maps is there, right there on that page. And that's basically it. I mean, you can install all of them if you want, or just those two. I only install those two. Configuring mail is simple. All you have to do is input your uh, username, password, your mail server. You can even use Gmail, .Mac, whatever email you have. Pop three, IMAP. It, it all works. Um, it'll set it up for you automatically. You might. If you if your server uses um, you know out, outgoing ports that are not the default, um, you'll have to edit it through the settings. Go to the settings and you'll have the mail settings in there, and you can just edit it from there. It's really really easy to set up. Check this out. I mean, if you have to have a jailbroke iPhone in order to do it, though. All the information I'll have in the show notes. But this is sweet. Forget the twenty bucks. Jailbroken iPod. Install the applications this way. You're good to go, man. This is the best techie.net show. You're watching it live.besttechie.net. If I happen to not be streaming, but you want to come chat with us, we have a chat room there at live.besttechie.net. You can come join us and chat. We're friendly people, so stop by, give us a shout, say hi, call your mom, you know, just tell her hi or something like that on air. You know, we'll tell them. We'll say, I'll say I'll wave to your, you know, your parents, your your sister, your brother. It's all good. Come check us out. We'll, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.